Alex Medical Lasers was actually established in 1985 and we are South Australia's largest medical device manufacturer. Alex produces lasers and ultrasounds to treat eye diseases and eye conditions. And that's largely glaucoma, diabetic retinopathy, secondary cataracts, vitreous opacities, and age-related macular degeneration. So Alex has about 285 people globally, so because we have offices overseas in Europe, in the US, and Japan as well. Here in Australia, we have over 160 people employed. We moved into these purpose-built premises in early 2017, and that's given us the capacity to grow and explore a number of other opportunities for the company on, a, on the global stage. To make a high-tech company work these days, you need technical skills, because you have to have people with really high technical skills as, this, as that's your ticket to play. So South Australia is actually an excellent place to develop and commercialise medical devices. It builds on a number of other industries that we've had here. So in, in terms of LX itself, our origins in the laser area come out of the fact that South Australia was a hub for the defence industry. It was actually a globally known hub for the defence industry. So there was engineering and development capability related to lasers in the early days that 30 years ago uh, flowed into the LX uh, developments of lasers. So a number of the initiatives from the South Australian government over the last few years have been very helpful, both directly and indirectly. The direct assistance is provided by some of the grants that help de-risk projects that we uh, haven't yet commercialised or are moving to commercialise. So there's programmes and grants like the one that assisted transformation from the automotive industry, um, there's a, the clusters programme that they've had previously, and some of the technology commercialisation grants that are available. Indirectly, the assist, the, what's really helpful is some of the, the group initiatives that take us global. We've been to China, we've been to um, areas that, which, with the emerging markets where it's not always easy to make your own presence. It's really been assisted by the South Australian government initiatives. Mm -hmm.